This is Commandante Failure here, and this is Tropico 5. Yeah, it's a brand new series. Something a little bit different, something, uh, well, it's not that different, is it really? It's more building. Uh, building is my thing. Um, so I'm in the character creator at the moment, and uh, let's just skip forward and get my name right. Uh, Fabian? No. Fabio. Fabio Failure. Uh, about to take over ownership of a brand new, uh, brand new island. What's what's going on here? Uh, no, let's. Uh, hmm. No, don't fancy. No, definitely not. That's a bit more me. Yes. Uh, no, I think uh, I think we'll go something. Uh, that's 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 very much my style, and uh, um, we'll keep it fairly traditional. Now, normally, I would uh, I would spend about uh, six months in the character creator before actually getting into the game, but I will spare you that. I think a, a snazzy white kind of get up there is kind of fun, and just get some. You know, we got some decent red strides here that will match my uh, match my cuffs. There we go. Look at that. Beautiful. Uh, hair colour. No, I'm not feeling... I'm not feeling that. Well, let's... Uh, just select... See, look, I'm already getting sidetracked here. I just want a magnificent moustache. You don't get much more magnificent than that, do you? And then uh, we'll... Uh, there we go. Nice. We're going to have this matching with strides as well, and then some form of some form of hat. Hey, hey that's not bad. But well, well, let's let's crack on. See what else we can find. I'll get to the game, honest. Any any time soon. So I'm in uh, sandbox mode here, and uh, I think it's got to be that, really, hasn't it? And then uh, oh yes, some ripping ripping shades. Actually, I think we'll just go with regular specs. I'm a regular specs kind of a guy. There we go. Those will do. Smashing. So I've uh, I've decided to be a. Uh, what have I decided to be? Um, uh, who? The what? Uh, uh, foreman. That's what I've decided to be. Yes, gives me a, a slight production boost on certain buildings, and and that's uh, I'm I'm all about that. Now I've not played massive amounts of Tropico Five. I have played a lot. Of previous games in the series. Uh, so, uh, how's about. Greetings, we old cracking? chap. Have I got a deal for you today? As Have Crown you? Representative, I can offer you your very own trading. Fine, I'll buy the good one. Thank you. Uh, As you and... know, His Majesty is fond of setting fire to things. He has decided to build the world's Which largest are? bonfire yes, and yes. needs all the wood he can get. How exciting. Okay, so, um, yeah, I, uh, basically the, the principle for the, for the starting point of this game is to, uh, is to ensure we actually stay in power. <laughs> Sounds easy, right? Uh, well, I mean, if you uh, watched the... Uh, the multiplayer series that I stuck on with uh, with his orbital of potato, um, you will recall that uh, that frequently he would get ousted by the government before actually getting anywhere. So we're going to try and get a little bit further than that. Uh, that's a sense of, hold on, is that me wandering around there? What steady on? There we go. Look, that's me. I'm out. Impressive in my red strides and my white jacket. Good looking fella. Now, the way I tend to play these games, uh, well, these uh, Tropico uh, games, tropical, Tropico series of games, is uh, I'm very much uh, a uh, make a heck of a lot of money kind of a guy. That tends to be the way that I roll. But I've got uh, my, my aspiration in this will be to, uh, to cause trouble for other world powers, uh, hopefully in such a way that... Uh, that we can we can get some get some action going. Um, so as so I'm planning on building up a, a relatively fine fine military, um, I'm not actually thrilled with uh, with the placement of some of this stuff to start with. It always feels like 
having my palace right in amidst various forests and, uh, and farms. His and royal shanties. majesty has instructed me uh, to present you with this letter of commendation for your achievements in the name of. I'll take the cash, thank you. So that was a, a, a bonus there for uh, building my logging camp. Okay, here we are at the dock. I don't want the dock, I want uh, trade routes. Okay, so trade is kind of one of the, the, the biggies uh, for, uh, there we are, look. Uh, is one of, yeah, is one of the big deals in this uh, this evolution of the game. And the first thing I'm going to do, uh, you'll have noticed I stuck a, a tobacco plantation down a minute ago, is I'm going to, uh, I'm going to take up a, a tobacco trading route, which should make me a little bit more cash. All about the cash, because obviously with cash you can uh, you can really get stuff done. I want to get another tobacco farm in if possible. Let's uh, no, see that's the wrong button. Do you fancy? There we go. A bit of a bit of a rotate on you there, friend, and we're all happy. We'll bang that in there, and we'll stick some more food next to it as well. And this time we'll. What do you feel about pineapples? Pineapples feel good. Okay, cool. Uh, and this way we get a little bit of food diversity for the, the, the happy-go-lucky folks uh, on my uh, on my island. While at the same time, another cash crop that I can potentially sell. So let's squeak a road in there. And then we'll take it around the side of this field. Hold on. Plantation. I should, I should call it what it is, really, shouldn't I? Uh, yeah, it's a plantation, not a field. There we go. Yeah, it's not the neatest thing in the world. Don't, uh, you know, don't get too fixated on, on any of this being neat. That is not going to be my objective. Successful. That is the goal. Uh, and that's uh, that's where we're going to go. Well, that's, that's enough of that. What are you? You're a country house. I should probably build some more of those. But I have to, uh, you know, I have to be just a little wary of not... Um, uh, what's the what's the phrase I'm looking for here? Yeah, not overextending. I was that's what we want to avoid early on is is trying to build too much too quickly because then nothing gets built. And as much as I can I can prioritize uh, different uh, different buildings in the in the construction queue. We don't want to we don't want to get to the point where we're waiting endlessly for stuff to be done. So we've got right now. I imagine this is corn. Yeah. So corn is kind of the uh, uh, the, the local food stuff of choice here. As tobacco will be uh, will be quite happily traded. Okay. Technological right. progress is the path to a Tonabi governor. Okay. We need more scientists to think important thoughts and discover new stuff. Good. Okay. So I've got to build a library. Now that's something that actually I don't mind having directly outside the uh, the palace of me, my palace, Uncle Failure's magnificent palace of justice. We'll, we'll be all about that in a moment. Uh, come on, you know you want to. Look, you're, you're, there's. I swear there'll be a game at some point that doesn't fight me on every road. There we go. Let's put it in there. And actually, while I'm here, get, get rid of that. Give me this. Uh, I want some housing. Let's uh, squeak a country house in there if we can. Marvellous. Uh, so the reason for building country houses is because right now uh, we've got chaps living in these I don't know, favela-esque uh, shanties. And uh, that simply will not do. Stop it. Uh, the reason I keep pulling that up accidentally is the build menu, for reasons best known to the developers, is on the right click. I mean, I guess once you're used to it, that's probably quite convenient. But it's kind of counterintuitive to everything else that I play that uh, right click will move your uh, move your view around. Now, do you want to go in a straight line up there? That would be handy if you did. There you go. That'll do for now. Okay, splendid. Right, so once I've got, so we've got two plantations up here being built, another tobacco and pineapples as well, and then I've got this little house being built. Once they're done, I'll get my library underway. 
Uh, I mean, we're we're four k in the hole at the moment. Uh, that's that's not terrible. Stop it. Yeah, every time you do that, you can. I mean, if if anybody's keeping score of just how many times I inadvertently call up the build menu, I'll stop doing it at some point. I'm sure. So this chap in his stockings there, slinging together a new farm. Let's uh, let's up the tempo and get this get this done rapido, shall we? There we go. Right, good. Another farm up. Uh, actually, I'll have a quick look. What? Oh no, hold on. His Majesty wants to exchange wood for sheep. Wood okay. for sheep? Anyone? Well, if you don't want sheep, then I guess you'll have to take money instead. Okay, we will we'll do that. Uh, some form of sheep farm here. So I'm going to play nice with his Madge uh, for a little while. Where are we? Uh, cattle. Uh, wool. I guess that's llamas, right? What? Are, what's the... Uh... Oh, I've got to export logs. Fine. Okay. Well, I am exporting logs already, so uh, so that's perfectly acceptable. Uh, as if by magic, I have uh, I've come up trumps on on back in the right horse. Actually, didn't they want a logging camp? Yes, they did want a logging camp. So I've already I'm already equipped with uh, with the suitable paraphernalia to get stuff done here. Okay, we're nearly done on these last two. There we go. That's another plantation built. President, as Hello you know, there. it is your will alone that keeps Tropico together. Without you. The entire island would crumble to dust and be yeah. lost forever. Yes, thank you and your generic Latino accent there. This is uh, stock accent 4B. Uh, let's have... Do we want some kind of tough guy? Yeah, I think I'll... As the air was born, all go. animals became quiet. A light shone through the skies an and La Chupacabra Harvest. herself went to the crib and bowed to the infant. At least... That is what we will write in the history books. Let's have the money. Well, hello there, Pia. Pia, my daughter. Uh, <laughs> she looks. She just looks a little hacked off. However, her main cut. Let's get her in the right uniform. There we go. Separation colour is whatever the red was that I was using. Bordeaux. There we go. Excellent. Uh, hair colour ginger. No. I mean, she's. I mean, as much as you know, baldness could run in a family. I think extending it to the lady folk is perhaps a mistake. Uh, anyway, let's uh, let's give her some kind of suitable hat. Yes. Actually, I quite like that. I quite like the look. I mean, yeah, I like that as a look. Okay, uh, ginger hair. Let's give her slightly darker hair here. And I don't think she's... I, I think uh, some sort of myopia is going to be uh, familiar to everyone in the family. Okay, right. Welcome to the team, Pia. There you go. Here's me. Here's my daughter. I'm a handsome looking dude. She, not quite so much. Anyway, good. Right, so she's going to increase wealth for 20% of the workers in the building. Ah, okay. That's, that's good. Okay, good. Right, anything else? No. Oh, I see. I can only select one of them. Well, I'll, I'll select me. Pester sure. someone else. Jolly good. Right. Uh, okay, so, good. That's both of us, uh, both me and, and my daughter there, uh, operating, operating well. Who do I want to keep happy? I think I want to get, keep the, keep the Teamsters, uh, on board. Let's, uh, let's uh, stick, stick Pier on board looking after the Teamsters, because the Teamsters are going to be, oh, stupid flaming thing, uh, are going to be exporting my, uh, my goods from wherever they are built, harvested, constructed, however you wish to describe it, and then uh, and then taking them to the docks to uh, to take elsewhere. Right, I actually do want to press this now. 
Uh, welfare is medium. Give me, give me, give me a, a grocery. I should probably start to think about where I'm going to have people live. I mean, obviously, I don't want them right outside the palace. <laughs> what do you think I am? Uh, and then we also want uh, a library. There we go. Right. Now, the library, I am quite happy to have directly outside the... Uh, the presidential mansion. I am but humble and of the people and as such I deserve to live in a presidential mansion. Good. Right. Okay. How's my tobacco crop getting on? We've made a thousand so far. Lifetime. If I had a few more workers that would help. I uh, want no. stupid button arrangement. Uh, okay, right. Well, you know, as I get more citizens, this this will uh, this will improve things. Uh, I can explore for a ground. I'm gonna explore. Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Now, I just want to have a quick look at not oh, not overlays. I want I want the almanac. Almanac. So we've got a workforce of 58. I've got eight jobs available and nobody is unemployed. So I need to get some people up in here. Ah, oh, there we go, 22 citizens arriving as if by magic. Hello folks, I've got gigs for you. In your matching outfits. Exciting things are coming your way. Yeah, you see, I, my, my exports aren't really up to much just yet, but they certainly will be as time goes on. The only thing I really need to keep an eye on right now, however, is is my, my term of office. So I've got three years, two months left to, uh, left to serve before, uh, before I, I get slung out by his match. So I do want to ensure that, uh, that I can declare independence before then. That will be a useful, a useful thing to do. Okay, library's going up, groceries almost up. So I'm going to try and build this section here out to be kind of, I guess you'd call it like the main housing area. But certainly, I want to stick a lot, of, a load of people down there. So let's uh, let's road out, and then we'll get some houses built because uh, critical to uh, to your success in terms of declaring independence is actually getting people out of their shanties and into something that actually resembles an actual house. Let's go that way. And then just to break things up, we'll we'll go the opposite way. There you go. Four. That that will that will cheer folks up. Obviously, don't forget to build the library first. Now I believe I need someone of yeah, see I need someone with high school education to work there, and for 500 quid I can have a foreign worker, so I shall do that. And then we wait. I could go fast forward, but it does seem to rattle forward at a heck of a rate by doing so. You chaps want to work a little bit harder. Because there's, you know, there's money in the bank. I mean, I can get, a, I can get another year's worth of extension by... Uh, by getting my my logs. Technological done. progress is the path to autonomy. His Majesty wants to exchange wood for sheep. I am wood aware for of this. sheep. Anyone? Yes, I am aware that you want wood and sheep. Wood and sheep. There we go. Right. Okay. So I'm going to start upgrading my my farm output as quickly as possible because that will make me some cash, which will facilitate additional growth. But not as much as getting me logs rolling. There we go. So I've got the worker turned up to man the uh, the, the grocers here. Ah, and the excellent, good. And the library is also now rolling. This is all good stuff. So at this at this early stage is you know there's not a not the hugest amount of things going on in the early stage, but uh, but we will get there. As time goes on, you know what, I want these trees out of the way of the magnificent vista that lies before my palace. Well, okay, so so it's a mountain, but you know, it's a it's a magnificent mountain. 
Let's see, we've got what have we got here? Well, iron. Okay. Okay. Well, that's that's helpful. Having an iron mine right on my doorstep. Now, I imagine these are full already. Yep, four of four. Three of four. This is this is fine. I'm I'm quite happy to provide uh, free housing for my people, and uh, I believe it will keep them extra specially loyal. And where His we Royal are? Majesty has instructed me to present you with this letter of commendation Excellent. for your right, achievements in the name of the mandate. Empire. I'll have an extra year to... Uh, Did you know that there are treasures buried on our island? There. We should investigate. Okay, I shall research the shovel. Uh, where are we? Research. Shovel. There we go. I've got it in the queue. She wants me to research a shovel. I, that's exactly what I'll do. Right, uh, 20 more people just turned up. What have we got? We've got eight unemployed. Well, let's do something to... Uh, Make a smidge more cash, I reckon. What, what do we think? What do we what do we fancy here? I mean, we could go more logging, I guess, but uh, logs are no longer critical to my success. Milk and meat, milk, meat, and wool. Uh, what do we think? What do we think? I think this land isn't particularly suited to that, so I'm going to kill that and we'll do another plantation. Okay, so I've got pineapples, I've got two tobacco. I mean, I could just go mad on tobacco, I suppose. Uh, how do I feel about tobacco here? Oh, you see, loving it. There we go. Because obviously, as a uh, as a, uh, a Caribbean dictator of sorts, uh, selling cigars is, is very much my thing. And, I mean, you've seen my get-up, so, uh, you know, how can I not... How can I not be a... Uh, Great uh, news. Mr. While Hello searching there. through the crates of colony supplies, we found a sickle. Excellent. Now we have something. Okay. Yes, 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 yes. Save it for the tourists. Uh, right, good. So we've completed our first piece of research, which will help our farms deliver a little bit more. Free and easy. Uh, I'm also... Get off the road. Get off the road, Paul. I also want to build... Where are we? Give me a wharf. We shall get some uh, additional food coming in in the shape of fish. Fish. Wharf. And we'll park it right on the end of that road. Fantastico. Alright, you all the way out there. Okay. Yeah, you coping? Yes? Good? Right. And then we'll drag this all... No, 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 you had it. That No, that's where I want you. There you go. Uh, and then we can, you know, by building a few more houses out here... See, this is going to this is going to pay off, I think. If I uh, just give it another access road, kind of an idea around the side. And then we'll take it out there. And I'm going to put another logging camp in there. Uh, simply because if I just stick a building on top of it, that's that doesn't do me any favours at all. I mean, you know, it gets rid of all the logs quick sharp, but I don't make any money out of it. So we'll stick that there, and you can you can go chopping. Okay, we're coming along nicely. Uh, three and a half years, give or take, still in power to go, and uh, and the population's growing ni nicely, nicely to ninety. And we'll wrap it up there. Uh, thank you very much for watching. I've been Colonel Failure. Um, we're going to continue with this, uh, possibly uh, as, a, as an irregular series. I shall try and try and get a new episode out every week. Um, but let me know what you think. Do you want to see more? What should I pursue? Uh, how, how do you think I should proceed with things? Uh, anyway, thanks very much for watching today. Uh, chuck us a like, if you wouldn't mind. That would be appreciated. And subscribe, if one has not done so already for subscribing is a beneficial thing to humanity and well specifically me um yeah there you go i'll catch you next time thanks for watching cheerio